This book's from our learning range, but it really helps any little one that's about to start school and is perhaps feeling a bit nervous. This will help put their mind at ease. It's called The First Day at School, and this book has been personalised for Oliver, but you can personalise it for anybody in your family. Let's take a look. Time to get up, Oliver, Mummy called. Today is an exciting day. Oliver started to get out of bed, but didn't feel excited. Oliver felt wobbly and nervous. What if the bigger boys and girls are too big, asked Oliver over breakfast. I might get squished. Don't be silly, replied Daddy. Oliver wasn't so sure. What if the teacher is a giant monster, asked Oliver. They might gobble me up. Don't be so silly, said Mummy. The school gates looked big and scary as Mummy, Daddy and Oliver walked through them. They could see the big boys and girls running around the playground. Oliver held Mummy's hand a little tighter. When they got inside, there was a peg with Oliver written on it. You get your own special peg, said Mummy. Near the pegs were the doors to the toilets. There were toilets for girls and toilets for boys. Put your hand up if you need to go, said Daddy. Oliver kept hold of Mummy's hand until they got into the classroom. The classroom had tables and chairs. There were drawers with names on, including one for Oliver. Mummy leaned down to give Oliver a kiss. I will come back to get you at the end of school, she promised and gave Oliver a big smile. Oliver now felt very funny. The teacher was called Miss Fox and she looked very nice. She read everyone's name out to make sure who was there. Oliver made sure to answer when Miss Fox called out, Oliver. After the register was done, Miss Fox asked everyone to line up by the door as they were going to assembly. Oliver didn't know what assembly was, but Oliver felt strange again. Oliver followed the line and Miss Fox to the big hall in the middle of the school. Inside were big boys and girls sat on the floor in rows. There was a big space at the front of the hall and Miss Fox showed Oliver and the new class where to sit. Assembly was fun. They got to stand up and sing songs and listen to Mr Badger tell a story. Mr Badger is the head teacher and he is in charge of the school. When they got back to the classroom, Miss Fox asked everyone to paint their favourite thing. Oliver loved painting and Miss Fox was very nice. She was friendly and gave everyone a kind smile. The funny feeling in Oliver didn't feel so funny anymore. Hello, I'm Oliver. What's your name? I'm Henry Hedgehog, he replied. I like your ears. Thank you, said Oliver. I like your spikes. Henry smiled and looked less nervous. Oliver was feeling much better. It was now playtime and Oliver went outside with the other children. That's where Oliver met Sammy Squirrel, who knew lots of fun games they could play. They all had lots of fun running around and playing together until the bell rang to call them back inside. Back in the classroom, Miss Fox had pinned all their paintings to the wall. The painting right at the front of the class was the one that Oliver did. Miss Fox talked about ABCs and 123s, but before long it was lunchtime. Oliver didn't feel funny now. Oliver felt hungry. The lunch hall was big and noisy with lots of big kids. Oliver joined a queue with new friends and saw the dinner ladies serving yummy food to everyone. After eating everything, Oliver went outside to play with the other children. In the afternoon, Miss Fox told all the children it was story time. Everybody came and sat on the carpet around Miss Fox's chair. She read from a big book with colourful pictures. Everybody listened, but before long the bell rang. Home time, said Miss Fox. Today had been fun. Oliver ran outside where Mummy and Daddy were waiting along with the other mummies and daddies. The school gates didn't look so scary anymore. Oliver took Daddy's hand as they walked through them, waving goodbye to Sammy Squirrel and Henry Hedgehog. Can I come again tomorrow? Oliver asked Daddy. Of course, smiled Daddy. How was your first day? Mummy asked. Tell me and Daddy all about it on the way home. The end.